welcome back to my channel this is Laura coming to you with another Dollar Tree haul I did find a couple of things that I'd like to share with you from the Dollar Tree I didn't pick up too much stuff this time because there really wasn't a variety of stuff out yet at my Dollar Trees but before we get started if you are new here I really would appreciate it if you would consider hitting that subscribe button turning on that notification bell and you will be notified every time I upload a video and you will not miss an episode if you are a regular here, thank you for spending time with me. I appreciate you. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to jump in with the food items first, since that's what's right in front of me. Let me show you what I found. Okay, the first thing that I found that I have never seen at one of my Dollar Trees is this Nature Zone, which is a brand name bread. I normally buy this at my regular grocery store, and it is not a dollar. I can guarantee you that. And this is the exact one that I buy, the honey oat. It is very good. If you find it, pick up a couple. It freezes well. Throw one in the freezer. Keep one out to use. It's really good. You won't be disappointed. A new item that I found that I was really excited about. This is by Nature's Grain. Original English muffins. You get a six count and that's 12 ounces. And these go really well with an egg in the middle or some bacon, some Canadian bacon. These are really good, guys. And I was very happy to find these. These are not new at the Dollar Tree. These are pitted black olives. I use this a lot in salads for the summertime. I always try to keep one or two on hand. And I had used up one for a recipe that I made that's going to be coming to y'all very soon. So be on the lookout for that. And this is six ounces of olives. A new Prego brand, the classic Alfredo sauce. You get 14.5 ounces. I figured if you need a shortcut, a quick dinner, toss some fettuccine pasta, throw this on top, sprinkle some Parmesan or Romano cheese, and you're good to go for a quick dinner. And for a dollar, I can't even believe that. Another new item, the Brims. The Brims brand is not new to the Dollar Tree, but I have never seen these. These are crunchy cheese curls. I guess these are like the Cheetos. I have not tried them. If you have tried these, please let us know in the comments if they are good. I will probably have some of these later on and I'll let y'all know if they are nice and crunchy and cheesy. The last item I got for food and drink is this Healthy Balanced Old Orchard Strawberry Watermelon. You get a half a gallon and it is the diet, so it is a sugar-free product. I have never tried it. I'm going to give it a try and see what I think. And that's a pretty good size for a dollar. By the way, guys, if you are one of the one that always gives my videos a thumbs up, I just want you to know that I appreciate you and that really helps me out here on the channel. So thank you for all your thumbs up. We're going to jump on into the crafting section. Not too much stuff there, but still a, a couple of new things that I really like. I did pick up three of these pumpkin fillers for the fall. They are called pumpkin fillers. These are pretty nice guys. They will make a good wreath or even standing alone in a vase. I think that would be great. And I know that they're going to go fast so I always start to pick up the fall stuff when I see it. I picked up two of these little buckets. I don't think these are new but I have never seen them in gray. This is a two pack. I am going to use this in my new office to hang on a little rod to put my everyday items like pins or scissors or rulers in here and that are easy accessible to me so I think these are going to be really cute I might even put a label on them with my Cricut to make them look a bit more upscale and I thought that was pretty good two for a dollar the next crafting item that I found was this burlap ribbon all the fall colors look at that how pretty that is the first one is a dark brown it is two and a half inches by two yards and this is a dark brown. This is a orange, a real vibrant, really, really pretty orange. And this is a red, a very dark, dark red, real pretty. The last one is just a natural or neutral color in a very light brown or tan color. And those are going to be make some really nice bows for some fall wreaths. And then I picked up a couple of new candles. This is by the Sure Sense apple cinnamon and they are three and a half ounces this one is sure sense in berry blast and this is what they look like i'm going to open one so you can see what the actual product looks like and look at that you can reuse the little container i thought that was pretty nice Mm, and they really do smell really nice. Always trim off some of the wick before you start so your candle can burn evenly. In the kitchen section, I picked up another one of these little spatulas. 
They don't have too many more of these around, so I'm, I'm assuming that they're going to phase them out at some point, but these are really good. I use them all the time to scrape out mayonnaise in a jar, peanut butter, just to mix up a couple of small things. They come in really, really handy. I have really enjoyed these. I picked up another two of the Scrub Buddies. These here are scouring pads. You get two. I'm going to bring you up close so you can see. You can see the texture on that. It's kind of rough. It feels like, like metal, but it's not metal. And then the back side is just a regular sponge. I had picked these up in the copper color. They are wonderful, but I have not been able to find the ones in the copper. So I'm still on the lookout for those so I can stock up on them. But I think these are gonna be pretty much the same concept as the other ones. So I was happy to find those. And as soon as I walked into all my stores, they did have the Scotty's brand tissue. You do get 148 two-ply tissues which is a great buy for $1. Jumping on to Bath & Beauty, I did need some cotton swabs, so I did pick up this small container. It is 150 count, which is not new to the Dollar Tree, but still $1 for these. Okay, these are new. These miniature size mini tweezers, you get three piece, you get a pointed tip, a slanted tip, and a flat edge. I will bring you in close for this. These are gonna come in really handy to throw in your purse and your cosmetic bag or for everyday use. I don't know if they're very good because I haven't tried them, but if you have tried these, let us know in the comments if they're good so we can all know. Maybe I'll go pick up another uh, set of these because I'm always losing tweezers. I, I don't think I'm the only one, but tweezers just disappear. I did find some new eyelashes. A lot of my makeup stuff is packed away so I'm having to go and find these. These are the same style. I'm going to bring you in close but the boxes are just a little bit different. And I have told y'all in the past that these are really good lashes. I love these lashes. They were running out there for a little while. I couldn't find any but they were back so I picked up three more. Then I picked up this new clip. This is called a claw clip and it did seem like it was real nice and strong. A lot of the times the clips at the Dollar Tree are just no bueno. And I do love this teal color and it is large. I thought this was pretty good. It's new to my Dollar Tree. And then I finally found the white velvet scrunchie. I did show in a past haul where I found the emerald green, the blue, the beige. They are just wonderful, but I was really happy to find the white one, and they only had one, so I'm still going to be on the lookout. I'd like to get a couple more of these. I, they're really, really nice. Very well made. In one of the aisles, just on a strip, I did find this work light. It reads, intense light, 106 lumens, white magnet, requires three AAA batteries, which are not included. I'm going to give this a try before this video goes up and I will let y'all know if I like it and if it's very bright. But I always like to have these around the house in different areas, never know. In the party section, I did find this chair cover. I thought this was pretty cool. I'm always picking up stuff to go with party for party supplies. I keep them in a bucket. Somebody needs them. Just take them. We use them. This is what it looks like. Right there, you cover the chair. I thought that was pretty nice for just a dollar. I mean, you can really go all out now decorating for a party with the supplies from the Dollar Tree. They are really super nice. They are really stepping it up there in the party supplies. The last department that I shopped at was the toy department. This is the last few items of the video. If you stuck around this far, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Okay, I did find these Turbo Wheels motorcycles in a red and a blue. Look at the size of these motorcycle guys. They are really, really impressive for $1. I have never seen these at my Dollar Tree, but I thought these were pretty, pretty nice for a dollar. I cannot even believe that. So my godson's going to be real happy to play with these. And then the last toy and the last item for this haul are these cars. Look at these vibrant colors. Let me show you here. Look at that. How cool that is. They have the red. Look at that. How nice. They have it in blue. They have it in green. And finally, 
they have it in orange. It is coming across a little bit lighter on the screen, but it is very typical orange, just really, really nice. So I thought these were pretty nice for a dollar. I mean, and they're, they seem like they're real sturdy and they're gonna hold up. So my godson's really gonna enjoy these. Okay guys, that was the last item for this video. I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, please give the video a thumbs up, share with family and friends, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.